Let us solve two numerical problems from the frequency modulation. So, before solving, let us discuss the, the important equations that we discussed. The instantaneous carrier frequency of the FM modulated wave Fi will be equal to carrier frequency Fc plus K times Es. Here K is the frequency deviation constant and then we have the the voltage of the instantaneous voltage of the FM wave E is equal to amplitude of the FM wave or oh sorry amplitude of the carrier wave into cos of omega c that is the, the carrier frequency T plus modulation factor MF into sine of the signal frequency omega s into T and the modulation factor mf this modulation factor mf is defined as delta omega c by omega s that will be equal to delta f by fs and that will be equal to fc maximum minus fc by fs these are the equations then we have the frequency spectrum frequency spectrum the spectrum will be fc plus fs fc plus or minus 2 times fs fc plus or minus fs then you also carrier frequency fc first then fc plus fs fc plus or minus 2 times fs fc plus or minus 3 times fs fc plus or minus 4 times fs etc these are the frequency spectrum okay now let us solve a problem The question is a frequency modulated voltage wave is given by E is equal to 12 cos 6 into 10 raised to 8 plus 5 sin 1250T. Find the carrier frequency, signal frequency, modulation index, maximum frequency deviation and the power dissipated by the FM wave in a 10 ohm resistor. Okay. So, this question is the carrier wave in the sorry, carrier wave in the amplitude mode, sorry, frequency modulated wave in the equation given on. Now, this equation is the term of identify any question. So, frequency modulated wave in the general equation we have already discussed that is the voltage E is equal to the carrier amplitude E C into cos the omega C T plus modulation factor M F into sin omega st now let us compare these two equations so now our given equation is the amplitude the e is equal to 12 cos 6 into 10 raised to 8 t plus 5 into sin 1250 t okay so ec is equal to carrier amplitude 12 one so that is how much we then omega c omega c is equal to 6 into 10 raised to 8 modulation factor is 5 and omega s is equal to 1 to 5 0 okay so we have ec is equal to 12 volt then omega c is equal to 6 into 10 raised to 8 omega s is equal to 1 to 5 0 and modulation factor mf is equal to 5 Okay. Now, first question is what is the carrier frequency F. Now, the frequency we have the equation frequency omega om, angular frequency omega is equal to 2 pi F. This is our equation. So, frequency F will be equal to omega by 2 pi. So, from here the carrier frequency F C will be equal to omega C by 2 pi. So, that means 6 into 10 raised to 8 by 2 into 3.14. Okay, calculate the substitute. So you have 6 by 2 into 3.14 is 6.28. 6.28. So that is equal to 0 0.955 into 10 raised to 8. Okay. Now this will be equal to 95.5 into 10 raised to 6 hertz or 95.5 95.5 95.5 95.5 95.5 95.5 95.5 95.5 95.5 95.5 95.5 95.5 95.5 95.5 95.5 95.5 95.5 95.5 95.5 95.5 95.5 95.5
95.5 megahertz okay now next question is what is the frequency of the signal so from here we we can write frequency of the signal fs is equal to 1250 same equation then we by 2 into 3.14 so that will be equal to 1250 by 6.28 and that is equal to 199.199199 hertz 199 hertz no point baki 008 factor ne adukunnalle okay or 199.04456 nokku veru yeah so that is the frequency of the signal now modulation factor mf is given already nammal discuss cheyidu the maximum frequency deviation yeah so what will be maximum frequency deviation we have modulation factor mf is equal to delta f by fs or maximum frequency deviation delta f is equal to mf into fs so this will be equal to 5 into what is frequency of signal 199 So, this is a thousand in that very value. One ninety nine, the two hundred nine, two hundred. So, this will be around nine 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 something. So, let us calculate five into one ninety nine. So, that will be equal to one nine nine five hertz. This is the maximum frequency deviation. And the last question is the power dissipated by the FM wave in term ten ohm resistor. we have the power dissipated p is equal to v square by r now here we have the voltage is e the carrier voltage or carrier amplitude ec by root 2 ivada nammal v rms aan consider cheyyanam nammal nerthu amplitude modulation la cheyidaan ee case so idinde square varum by r undavu so this will be equal to ec square by 2r and what is ec ec is equal to 12 volt So 12 square by 2 into R is 10 ohm resistor. So this will be equal to 12 into square 144. So you have 144 by 20. 140. That is 7.2. So this 7.2 watt will be the power dissipated by FM wave in 10 ohm resistance. So the first problem is over. Now let us solve another problem. The question is a 25 megahertz carrier is modulated by a 400 hertz audio sine wave if the carrier voltage is 4 volt and the maximum frequency deviation is 10 kilohertz write down the voltage equation of the fm wave okay so the carrier frequency fc is given to be 25 megahertz and the frequency of the signal fs is equal to if is equal to 400 hertz and the carrier voltage ec is equal to 4 volt and the maximum frequency deviation is given to be 10 kilohertz so first question write down the and if the carrier is write down the voltage equation of the fm wave so namaku voltage equation eduthanam we have the voltage equation is equal to ec cos omega ct plus modulation factor mf into sin omega st so this is our a this equation aanu namaku ezhudendathu okay so idinath namaku ec inde value already known aanu then fc fs undayathonda namaku omega c um omega s um directly namaku kaanan pattu okay so first of all evaluating omega c omega c will be equal to 2 pi into fc that will be equal to 2 into 3.14 into fc is 25 megahertz so this will be equal to let us substitute so you have 6.28 into 25 and that will be equal to 157 megahertz and next omega s will be equal to 2 pi fs and what is 2 pi fs that is 
टू पै इंटू एफ एस इज फोर हंड्रेड हेड्स फोर हंड्रेड हेड्स सो फोर हंड्रेड इंटू सिक्स पॉइंट टू एट एंड दैट विल बी ईक्वल टू टू फाइव वन टू हेड्स सो दिस इज ओमेगा एस एंड नौ वि हेव द मोडुलेन फैक्टर एम एफ मोडुलेन फैक्टर एम एफ इज ईक्वल टू डेलटा एफ बै एफ एस सो मैक्सीम फ्रीक्वेंसी डीवियशन डेलटा एफ विल बी ईक्वल टू एम एफ इंटू एफ एस एंड एम एफ इज गिवन टू बी सो वि हेव वट मैक्सीम फ्रीक्वेंसी डीवियशन इज गिवन सो वि हेव टू डिटर्मी एम एफ ओ सो दर इज नो नीड टू रईट डाउन दिस सो एम एफ इज ईक्वल टू डेलटा एफ इज टेन किलो हेड्स बै एफ एस इज फोर हंड्रेड हेड्स So 10 by 400. So again, evaluate that. 10 by 400. So our 10 is na kilohertz le ana. So this is 0.025 into 10 raised to 3 because 10 mugal le kilohertz ana thala hertz ana. So this will be equal to 25. 25. हेड्स मोडुलेन एम एफ सो हेड्स रू हेड्स क्यानस इट इस जस्ट ट्वेंटी फाइव सो नो इक्वेशन नमुक पेसीवल टू इसी इसी मीन फोर फोर वोल्टेज इंटू को नौ नेक्स्ट टाइम ईस ओमेगा सी टी ओमेगा सी ईस् वन पॉइंट फाइव सवन इंटू टन रेस टू सिक्स मेगा हेड्स ने या हेड्स मैटी इक्वेशन और यूनिट वे इंटू ओ वन फिफ्टी सवन मेगा हेड्स सो दिस् वि वन पॉइंट फाइव सवन इंटू टन रेस टू ए मेगा हेड्स सोरी एइट हेड्स इंटू टाइम टी प्लस मोडुलेन फैक्टर ट्वेंटी फाइव दिस् ट्वेंटी फाइव दें सैन ओमेगा सीक्वल टू टू फाइव वन टू ओके सो दिस् दि इक्वेशन the instantaneous voltage value of the of the fm modulated wave okay thank you